What's happening, La Familia YouTube? So, uh, I have a, a quick little unboxing here. Um, like I explained to you guys, I think I explained this in one of my older videos, that I'm trying to not um, as much be influenced by what's hype and more so just kind of looking back on things that released that aren't that hype but also are really cool looking, you know, by more hype brands. Um, as in case you haven't seen, I did a uh, uh, unboxing video, unboxing and on foot video if you want to check that out. Um, just look through my videos because I don't have that many yet for you to, you know, scroll through. <laughs> to I don't have that many yet to a point where scrolling would be annoying. So, getting close though. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, I did a uh, unboxing video for the uh, off-white Nike Vapor Streets because the um, the price, I could not pass it up. Um, uh, Nike was having a huge sale and um, I was able to actually secure those shoes for 150 bucks and actually I ended up having like a gift card of $40 on it so I actually only got them for 110 so I um, I was like hell this is you know you, you can never get an off-white for sale or, or excuse me an off-white shoe on sale um, no script people that's what happens <laughs> anyways um, because of that um, I bought them and I tried them out for like a couple of weeks and I got to tell you, for me, for my foot, they were the most unstable shoe I think I've ever walked around in. It was, I went for a walk, um, for a long walk in them uh, this last weekend. And I was like, oh yeah, there's no way I'm keeping these. And that was the other reason why I got them too, is because Nike actually has a really, really cool, really, really good return policy. So I was like, you know what? What have I got to lose? I can always return them. So I did end up returning them. And I ended up getting these, which I actually had my eye on for quite some time. And I just realized I don't have anything to open this with. So we're going to have to be resourceful here. And we're going to use this button. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I got these from, um, from Essence.com. Uh, by the way, if you are somebody that wants to find, you know, hype shit um, or semi-hype stuff on sale... Um, believe I essence is amazing uh, for that if you you know didn't know already it's a really really great site um, I actually got a couple of um, off-white shirts off there um, for got 70% off or something like that um, one day so and I thought I would never buy an off-white t-shirt or anything like that because they're so fucking expensive but these were too good to pass up so I ended up getting those but anyways essence is a great site for that and what we got in here is another off-white shoe, but it's not a collaboration shoe. And you probably already know that by looking at the title. Ooh, man, this is, this, okay, check that out. One of my favorite things, so I, I have the off-white um, Chuck Taylors, the ones that are like black, white, and orange. And it comes in a blue box, a blue Converse box, just like this. This is what I love about off-white stuff, man. Check that out. That is badass. And by the way, another thing about Essence, they usually ship their stuff like overnight. I actually ordered these shoes. Um, oh, yeah, I actually ordered these shoes um, pro at, like late at night on, what day is it? It's Wednesday. Okay, I ordered these shoes late at night on, um, on Monday night. And they got them to me by today. So, yeah, they shipped them out on, on Tuesday and they, and they came today. So... Pretty crazy shipping. You can't beat that. And you get stuff for sale. Check out the box. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I'm loving the box. The box is just gorgeous. Right there. And I don't know what these are called. By the time I post this video, the name of the shoe will be in the title. Um, this is... Okay, here it is. The Off-White Low Vulcanized. And the color is White Violet. Check that out. I like that. I like how everything with Off-White just basically looks like a sample. All right, here we go. First impressions. Ooh, best thing ever, man. Anytime you can get a dust bag for your shoes, I mean, come on. Come on now. That's just, that's beautiful. It's beautiful. Just gorgeous. 
Again, I love that fucking like teal. And it's not teal, but it's like an aqua color, I guess. Paper on deck. Kind of cool. It's like a, a card. It's got an adhesive on it. Obviously, it didn't stay. All right, let's open up the shoe. Ooh, hoo hoo. These are clean. Definitely like a canvas shoe. Um, damn, these are clean. These are nice, man. These are going to be a great summer shoe. Holy shit. Going to be a great summer shoe. I like how, and I'm not going to lie, I'm one of those dorks that wears the, uh, the um, zip tie. Roast me, at me, do whatever you want. I don't care. I think it looks cool, and I think it, that's the whole I mean, that's Off-White's whole thing is, is for it to your shoe to look like a sample shoe. And yeah, man, these are crazy. Check it out. It's the inside of them right there. It's got the uh, Off-White writing. Typical of Off-White. And we'll turn it around. Shoelaces on the shoelaces. And then the X, the reason why it's violet is because the X is more like a violet color. Man, you guys, these are mm, new shoe smell, off-white logo on the inside there. And check out the bottoms of these. Crazy. Wow, I am very happy. Very happy that I grabbed these. I just hope they fit. Um, they're size 46. I mean, it comes in European sizes. And according to a chart that I looked at, oh, by the way, nice little off-white 2013, right on the tongue right there. Hopefully I'm getting pretty close here. You see that? Pretty cool canvas shoe, man. Yeah, I, um, I think these regular price were like 400 bucks and I got them and they were having a, they're having a crazy sale right now where you get uh, a percentage off the sale prices. So I actually got these for 215 bucks after shipping and taxes and everything. So pretty good deal, especially for an off-white shoe, digging it. And these were actually made in Milan, Italy. So that explains the European um, or slash Italian sizing then, because it says it right in there. Pretty crazy. You know what, you guys? I think we need to try these on. I think we need to get some on feet, don't you think? And check it out. I'm wearing the right socks for them. <laughs> All right, let's do it. All right, La Familia YouTube. So a little bit of a bummer. Hold on, let me fix something. There we go. A little bit of a bummer, actually. These are actually really tight. Um, I think I needed to go up to a 47, which is kind of weird because I wear a 13. I heard that these were true to size, so I don't know. But um, they are a very cool looking shoe. Um, I especially love them on feet. And it makes me so goddamn sad that I may have to actually um, return them. So, yeah, man, uh, that sucks. But I'm going to check on this website, see if they have my size. Hopefully, I won't have to return them completely. Otherwise, if I do, it is what it is. You know, then I just save money that way. You know, by the way, um, I'm lucky enough to have a job still. Um, and it doesn't look like my job's going away anytime soon. I've also also worked from home. I always work from home uh, as well, too. So, you know, the quarantine has not affected me financially. So please, 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 when you're watching these videos and you're seeing me buy all this stuff, it's because I can actually afford it <laughs> because I'm still working. If you are going through a tough time right now, please, I beg you not to buy anything and just save your pennies until we're out of the woods with this whole thing. But uh, I'm, not you, I'm not trying to tell you how you live your life, but I'm just saying 
just think twice about stuff, you know, when you watch these sneaker YouTubers and stuff. Um, anyways, but that is all, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for enjoying the videos um, during this whole uh, stay at home, stay safe at home business. Um, fingers crossed I can get a bigger size in these, but uh, we'll see what happens. But until then, ladies and gentlemen, I am out of here. Yo, La Familia YouTube, uh, one last thing I wanted to add to the video. I actually am going to start doing some different kinds of videos that are not, you know, based on unboxings and whatnot. Uh, there's many reasons why my channels call people by their covers. Um, we're going to get into some of those reasons as I start putting uh, different content out. But uh, the uh, part of that, um, part of the name, the reasoning behind the name is fashion, obviously. And... Um, so my, for my next video, uh, actually, I'm going to be doing a Menlo Club unboxing this month. I'm going to be doing a big unboxing for that, so stay tuned for that. Um, going to be a good one. Actually, yeah, I'm probably going to do like a two-in-one or so. Anyways, <laughs> but my uh, video after that, what I'd like to do is do uh, a rate a rate your fit kind of video. So um, follow me over at Jason underscore wears underscore stuff on Instagram. Follow me. If you want, otherwise, send me a message um, with a picture of one of your coolest and hypest fits. And I'm um, probably going to pick about like 10 people. Uh, and then I'll feature you guys in my next video. And I'm going to tell you what I think of your outfit in my next video. So, and keep in mind, it's based on my own opinion. So, you know, hopefully I won't offend anybody with my opinion or anything like that. But, but yeah, uh, you know, send me some of those pictures, send me some of those fits. So that you can get featured in that video. And uh, yeah, probably going to do some more giveaways uh, coming up in the next couple months. Got a couple things that I don't need right now that are Menlo Club related that I'm not going to wear that I'd much rather give to you guys. And those giveaways actually did pretty well. So stay tuned for those as well. Now, I am out of here.